For us, it means that we can actually understand our customers' needs and actually meet them, rather than just giving them a product set that's made in China and we can't change it at all. It's, it's understanding what our customers need, it's meeting those needs, and it's delivering more value. Hi, my name is Elisha Nuttall, Managing Director of High Tech Aerials. So High Tech Aerials were founded in 1974. The founder started building aerials in his, in his garage and managed to get into supplying a lot of the emergency services quite early on and it's grown from there. I, I got involved late last year, met with the, uh, the owner at the time who was looking to retire and so I've been working with the, the previous owner who's uh, now consulting back. It's been great to, to get alongside the team that are here and, and bring some fresh ideas and look to try and take the, the amazing skills and, um, and experience we've got here and, and apply them in new markets and, um, and new sectors. You would think that, that radio uh, technology or aerials perhaps being such an old technology might be on the way out, but if anything it's just supporting more and more technologies. So um, we've still got our traditional segment which is radio tele telecommunications, uh, supporting aerials in that space. But more and more there's, um, there's other products coming out that need our expertise and we can locally manufacture for, one of which is uh, satellite connectivity for, for data transfer. And that's really exciting, that market, and we're excited to work alongside other companies, essentially doing R&D, improving their, their aerials and their, and their wireless uh, solutions. Yeah, we probably do 10,000 aerials a year, some you know, ranging from you know, this big right through to two plus meters. Some of the government agencies we work with, Department of Conservation, New Zealand Police, uh, Fire and Emergency, the ambulance providers and, and lines networks. So they're all running quite critical networks and, and often have critical communications as part of that to basically carry out um, their function. So whether that's rescuing someone from a national park or pulling someone out of, someone out of a burning building, their communications network is critical to that. And so yeah, they want to make sure that they've got the right hardware and the right designs and that their solutions last for a long time. For them, if we're able to customize the product to meet that particular location, yeah, maybe it means for them it's, it's easier to install, it might mean that it gets better performance, it might mean that actually it's going to last longer, it's not going to get blown off a mountain. So we, we think that that means like real value for our, for our customers and their networks that span, oh, they need to be operational for a, for a long time. Being in New Zealand, having all the capability here, customers can pick up the phone, can bring something in that's having a problem and we can meet those needs. 